short answer is we don't know how quickly it will spread. Um, the artemisinin resistance has rightfully excited a lot of interest. Um, some very simple basic research which could inform the, that question or the answer to that question is not being done. And I would uh, say that one of the major priorities right now is to map where it has spread to. And fortunately, the UK Department for International Development is supporting studies to do that. And a very simple thing which I have not been able to persuade anybody to support is to find out whether these parasites from Cambodia will uh, infect the anopheline ve vectors in India and Africa. Often a vector from one region will not accept parasites from another region. Um, and if that was the case, that the Cambodian parasites are not happy in the major vectors in India and in Africa, we've got some time. On the other hand, if, they, if it goes happily in off these Gambia or Arabinsis, um, then somebody's only just got to hop on a plane carrying gametocytes and can set the fire off elsewhere. Uh, the other thing we need to do urgently is to get some uh, baseline data from Africa. Because if we don't get a molecular marker quickly, then we're going to rely on the in vivo testing. We don't have the baseline data at the moment. So I think there's a number of things we should do on the research side urgently. Um, my own belief is that this will spread because resistance does uh, and I really don't know how quickly it will spread.